Hi, I'm Gary. Welcome to Jargon Free Help. This week, I wanted to share a tip with you on how you can scan this directly into your Mac using your iPhone. Now, you can scan this software, and I've got a video on how to do this that allows you to scan in using this. You just kind of hold it over the document and it detects the page and then it saves it and then you can email it to yourself or you can save it elsewhere as well. I've used it to save it to other places too. So you can go and check that out later, but you can skip that step if you want to put it directly into your Mac and you can use this to go into Word, which is what I'm going to do now. It also works in mail and in other applications as well, such as pages and Keynote and so on. So you can go and check that out. And it's really, really easy to do. So I'm going to scan this document here. But before I do that, the things that you do need to know is you need to have iOS 12 on here or, or greater. There is a new version coming out soon. And there is also a new version of OS 10 coming out, but this is Mojave. So those are the two minimum requirements. You need iOS 12 and OS 10 Mojave on here. You also need to be on the same network. You need the network turned on. You need Bluetooth turned on and you need to be signed into your iCloud account. Now, most of you probably have that all switched on all the time anyway, but if it's not working, that could be the reason why. So once you've got all of that done, this is really easy to do. All you have to do is here in your application, so I'm going to be doing this in Word, I just right click, or if I haven't got the right click set up, I can hold down control and click. You can see it's got import from iPhone or iPad. So you can see all the devices. These are the ones connected around the house that we've got. And you can see here it's got GS7. That's the phone I'm currently holding. And I click on scan documents and then it comes up on here just like that and you can see it here and if I hold it over the document you'll see it detects it and it takes a snapshot and I can press save and I'm just going to just press save on there and oh, it's actually done it twice you'll see it then immediately comes up on your Word document here and you would have seen a message about it as well before it actually did that. So that's how you can do it. I can then resize this. Of course, it's just like a photo now and I can do what I like. I can delete it and move it around within the document. So that's how you can use your iPhone to, or even your iPad to scan directly into your Mac if you've got things running on here that you need to scan directly into. So don't forget it works on things like Mail, Word, Keynote, Pages and quite a few others as well. So go and try that out. So that skips having to scan it into here and then email it across to yourself and then save that into a document. So if you want to see how to do that, go and check out that video. Thanks for watching. If you want to know more, subscribe to my channel below and I'll see you next time.